Hello, my beautiful Cancer friends. Welcome to the Spirit Fund. Um, let's see what's happening around you in the month of April 2021. This is a general reading, so it may or may not resonate and roles could easily be reversed. Feel free to have a look at your Sun, Moon, Rising sign readings here on the channel as well. And if you'd like a personal reading, the information should be below in the description. All right, Cancer, let's get started. Oh, Cancer, lots of water energy in your reading. So possibly this is just an indication that um, you've been in your feelings, you've been in your emotions. Um, they're not the happiest sign, um, happiest cards for cup cards. So possibly you've been in not the highest vibration when it comes to your emotions. I'm sensing a lot of disappointment. I'm sensing missed opportunities or feeling like something was a missed opportunity. I'm also sensing uh, just wanting to give up and walk away from a certain situation, a certain person, or possibly even from love as a whole. Um, I feel like something's got you in your feelings, in the negative feelings, unfortunately. Um, you possibly have been quite pessimistic, um, or maybe just not in the highest vibration. Uh, possibly you've been feeling like something hasn't been fair or maybe even something has been taking a lot of your energy in the sense of something external um, with that justice card it could be something with the legal system um, it's taken a lot of effort a lot of energy you're getting quite drained and you just want to get to the finish line with something okay um Look, you're a lot closer than you realize, but I think um, you just have to go through what you're going through for a reason. There are lessons that need to be learned within the sadness. Um, I know that sucks when you're the one going through it, but trust me, I feel like there's something beyond this that you can't see that um, with hindsight, this moment will make sense. Like I said, I feel like you're walking away from something, possibly something that you had been waiting for for quite some time or someone that you were waiting for. Um, right now, you're seeing them for what they are, which was a missed opportunity, someone very disappointing, someone who was holding back and not offering a cup of love. Possibly this is someone that... Um, said all the right things did all the right things in externally or on the outside hence these three cups but when it came to really giving that internal cup the truth um that just didn't seem to come in or maybe it did come in but something about its energy was a little off-putting which made you close off to it intuitively okay with that moon card i am sensing a lot of intuition going on here so and the moon can indicate um a cancer card so maybe you were just in your power and something intuitively pushed you in the direction of walking away because this person, it just feels like they were wasting your time, okay? Or this situation feels like it was wasting your time. Whatever it is, it does feel to me that it's created a little bit of an imbalance within you. And I think you feel like someone treated you unfairly or... I don't know, I just feel like you think someone maybe took advantage of you or took you for granted, but don't worry, um, they're going to get their karma with this judgment card, whether it's you seeing the karma or the universe giving them their karma, there will be justice in this situation. And if this is a legal situation where you are waiting to hear some sort of um, judgment, basically, uh, I feel like it's going to go in your direction i feel like whatever news is coming towards you in regards to this unfair treatment that you are feeling you are going to be very happy with the judgment at the end of the day after a very long period of having to wait okay possibly even wanting to give up and walk away but something's happening behind the scenes that you are not seeing that is actually working out in your favor that is going to restore balance in your life and possibly even bring joy back into your life i'm sensing you haven't been happy in quite some time um maybe externally you know, no one can tell that you're not the happiest. You've got this moon energy all around you, which could indicate that you've been wearing a mask, um, you know, smiling in front of people, just getting along. But it's when you are alone that the disappointment, the loneliness and the feelings of 
just like you haven't achieved what you've been wanting to achieve, that energy is what I'm getting here. Those feelings tend to overwhelm you when you are on your own, when the mask cannot be on because you're by yourself, you know. I guess some people, they can lie to themselves, but I'm sensing that no, with the sun card, you're not able to lie to yourself. You are fully aware of how disappointed you are in a situation um, and you're wanting to give up. Maybe you should just give up and let go, but right now, I just need to tell you that there will be some sort of judgment some sort of justice some sort of balancing of the scales seems to be coming in your direction you don't see it right now but trust that the universe is working in your favor okay pretty straightforward guys i hope it's helping and resonating let's clarify the cards what is that eight of cups so sorry i was about to say eight of pentacles two cards here um the knight of wands and the two of cups wanted to come in i don't want to know i don't know if it wanted to come in reverse or upright um i'm just going to take it like this because this energy seems to be how it wants to be coming out i feel like you're walking away from instability inconsistency people who are basically players people who are in and out people who are just as hot as they are cold um people who basically want their come in for their own intentions, want to serve their own happiness, but don't necessarily have your best intentions in mind. The Knight of Wands is someone who comes in very quickly, but leaves just as quickly. I feel like you've been dealing with some very charming people who've been promising you some sort of offer, but the offer never comes. And you've come to a realization that you have to walk away from either a specific person, a relationship, or these type of energies in general. People who, um, I have no idea what just happened there. It stopped recording. So I hope that doesn't happen again. But I'm just going to splice the two videos together. And yeah, let's see where this takes us. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. I have no idea what just happened there. But yeah, um, that was the Eight of Cups being clarified. Let us clarify the Five, Four of Cups. Sorry, I'm losing my focus now. I'm not sure why that just happened um very annoying okay let's clarify the four of cups please yeah i think that you're just tired of working on things that don't serve you working on people maybe you have that energy of wanting to fix people but i think you're starting to realize that it's not serving you you've been investing your time in things that just don't manifest you've been investing in energies that don't invest in you and that's been creating this disappointment because unfortunately these energies aren't manifesting in the right way because these people aren't putting in the right effort or this person okay let's clarify the moon wow nine of swords a lot of sleepless nights a lot of worry anxiety possibly even insomnia like i said i think you might be um a lot happier in public than you are alone and there's a lot of anxiety here so please be aware of that please try and heal that please try and get some sleep stop worrying about this person um and do understand that you're making the right decision what is this justice about why is the justice card here, universe? Yeah, whatever has been quite burdensome, whatever has been feeling heavy, it will be balanced out. You're dropping this burden of being disappointed, waiting for something, feeling anxious, not sleeping. You're walking away from this, and this is what's going to bring you your karmic justice, okay? I think you're going to feel a lot lighter the second you let this go, whatever it is. Why is judgment here? Ooh. Wow. 
Yeah, so something's about to shift in your life very quickly, unexpectedly, um, and it's going to be this energy of balance. Um, whatever you've been struggling with, whatever it is that you've been choosing to walk away from, this is triggering a shift from the universe. This is triggering the balancing out of the scales for you. It might be quite surprising and unexpected, but maybe now it won't be that unexpected because you got this reading, right? Let's clarify the sun. Okay. Wow. So you're definitely moving towards a much happier cycle in your life after a, a lot of disappointment. But do understand that if you went through these disappointments the way the universe was wanting you to then possibly you've learned a lot of lessons you've grown you've matured you've developed into this empress and it's from this empress energy male or female someone who's very nurturing and self aware nurturing of self um, loving yourself pouring into yourself not chasing anybody very important it's that energy that's actually going to manifest this happiness the stability and this happy home the white picket fence the ten cups someone who matches the empress okay a divine counterpart after all of these dare i say losers that you've been dealing with all right cancer pretty straightforward reading you've got here um i also feel like it's for a very specific group of you okay let me know in the comments um let's clarify a little bit further using the light seers tarot oh my god my card just fell into water oh my god <laughs> just got some goldfish so i'm culturing their water here right next to my reading and then my card fell right into the little tub oh my god cancer this is so beautiful maybe that's an indication of my cards falling into water that you are in your watery element right now <laughs> i'm trying to link it somehow but yeah we've got the page of uh, page of swords and the emperor and i just want one more card before i let you know what i'm sensing from that oh my goodness all right knight of wands again so yeah, you've been dealing with a lot of inconsistent people, very attractive people, very charming and alluring people, but unfortunately slightly immature when it comes to relationships or how they view relationships with you. This is someone who's just not, this is not someone who commits, unfortunately. And I think that this is the energy you've been dealing with. This is the energy you are turning your back on and you are choosing to put yourself first and hold what's dear to you near. I think you're focusing on your own wealth, your own business, your own knowledge. You are focusing on yourself, basically. And it's this energy, I promise you, of you elevating yourself as the empress, finding your own joy, your own inner happiness, that brings the stability in, this, in the form of your divine counterpart, a soulmate, dare I say, a twin flame, your husband, your wife, the mother of your freaking children, what a crazy reading that's not how i was expecting this reading to go because i mean i guess yeah you were walking away from something and you've just basically walked towards yourself and it's from this energy that you find your other half okay cool your grounding energy for the month of april my beautiful cancer is sad embrace we not the happiest looking card but let's see it might have a happy message i don't know i don't think i get this card too often so yeah let's see loss is a part of life let go and allow time to heal you wow that's definitely the energy you're in right now feeling like things just aren't coming towards you quick enough or things are leaving you too quickly you may be entering into a period where loss is a theme perhaps you're having to let go of a long cherished dream 
If so, take heart, for this ending may have been for your highest good. Wow. A better and more powerful dream will be realized in your life if you can accept the loss. Relationships built on faulty foundations are meant to end at this time. Disappointment is a form of perception. If your expectations weren't met, a sense of loss arises, along with sadness and grief. Express these emotions. Tears are like healing... Ooh. feel whatever you're feeling okay drop the mask <laughs> sorry where was i tears are like healing rain that can, that can restore life to a parched inner landscape Ooh, this reading is beautiful growth is always assured whatever the loss However great it is, let go and experience your feelings so that you may soon see what beauty lies ahead. Wow. Let your tears nurture this new phase that you are going into. Trust that um, things won't be as heavy as they are right now. The universe is balancing something out for you. By you focusing on yourself and walking away from what doesn't serve you, something beautiful is coming towards you unexpectedly. And to me, it feels like Someone who appreciates you and sees your worth and wants to step up and meet you at that, okay? Oh, lovely reading, Cancer. I hope it helps in any little way. Um, if you'd like a personal reading, remember the information is below. If not, catch you on the next one. Leave me a comment, like, share, subscribe, all of that jazz. Love and light.